Hi, I'm James from Redden FC Away Days, and this is On This Day in Reading FC History. In the year 2005, Reading travelled to Ipswich on the 22nd of November. With a win, Reading would get top of the league and would be 22 matches unbeaten since their opening day defeat to Plymouth. After defeating Hull at the weekend, Reading were looking for their fourth victory in as many games. And with 28 minutes on the clock, Bobby Kenvey ran down the wing and was able to spot Kevin Doyle inside the box. Now, Doyle's shot was saved, but the rebound fell straight to the feet of Steve Sidwell, who was able to put the ball in the back of the net to put Reading 1-0 up. Eight minutes after the break and Reading doubled the advantage. Kevin Doyle once again being involved in the goal, this time providing for Leroy Lita as he cut it back and Lita put the ball in the back of the net, curling it in the bottom right hand corner. And Doyle wasn't done there, this time Lita providing for him to score from a corner when Sonko flicked it onto Lita, Lita touching it down for Doyle to put it in the back of the net. 400 Reading fans travelled to Portman Road on this day and they were able to see Reading go top of the league. Now this is actually where Reading would stay for the remainder of the season in which is one of the most remarkable seasons by any team in English football history. Now I've been James from Reading FC Away Days. I hope to see you guys again soon. Cheers.